Yo, before this video gets started, I know y'all thought I was going to say drop a like for Chadwick. No, bro. All I'm asking you guys is to pay y'all respects. Either comment RIP in the, in the comments or just comment Wakanda forever. Now, he played way better roles, you know what I'm saying, than just Black Panther. So, I just want everybody in the comments to fill it up with Wakanda forever. RIP Chadwick. Rest in peace, my boy. I keep that lid on me like I got a text. Five cigarette, I need one when I'm straight. Looking to buy a stacked NBA 2K account with max badges and more. Visit SportsTMB.com. He has been in the community for years and has hundreds of reviews. Click the first link in the description to get your account today. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Charles. Okay, come back to another video, man. If you're new to the channel, I'm going to subscribe. You turn subscribe, I'm going to like, comment, I'm below. You know what I ain't doing, and turn on those post in the case so you never miss an upload from me. Yeah, boy. Also, in the comments down below is our 2K21 giveaway. That giveaway will end September 1st. That's coming, coming real, real fast. So y'all go in the comments down below into your chance to win a free copy of 2K21. But today, man, I got this badge just for y'all. Now this is gonna be real easy and simple for my people who's deciding to stay on. You know what I'm saying? 2k21 y'all i meant 2k20 when 2k21 comes out y'all cannot say i left y'all hanging i'm leaving y'all with a plethora of glitches to use if y'all don't want to you know what i'm saying upgrade to the new game because i will once 2k21 drops i will not be making no more 2k20 videos so y'all enjoy these this, this is gonna be the last week of these videos so yeah on to the glitch today to start this glitch you know what i'm saying it's gonna be real simple all you want to do is load up with the player that you want to do this on as you guys can see i got my player right here once you've loaded up all you want to do is hit the middle button of the controller go into your settings Go all the way down to application, save data management, 2K20 will close, hit OK. Now from here, you want to go to save data and system storage, then you want to head over to copy to USB storage, all right, and then select 2K20. And once you guys get here, you want to find your My Career Zero Zero file, as you guys can see, here is mine. Now if you don't know which one is yours, look at the time and pay attention to the date, always pay attention to that. But once you have found it, all you simply want to do is hit copy, hit apply to all, then hit yes. All right, now once you've done that, you're all done on your PlayStation 4. All you want to do is unplug your USB from your console and plug it into your computer, and I'll see you guys over there on your computer. Okay, now once you guys get on your computer and you plug in your USB, all right, you want to find your USB, and this, this is mine, says no name, but yours probably will say the actual name of your USB. It's just what it says on the Mac, no big deal. But you will have this folder right here, as you guys can see, that says PS4, okay? So you want to click that folder, I'm going to click it again, and then you want to get to the screen where you see all these numbers at. Now, um... You guys will only have one folder. In this instance, I know which one is mine, and it's the uh, the two the two D one. So let me just make it look like yours. So yours will basically look like this. Now, once you guys are to the folder, you know what I'm saying, with all the numbers or whatever, you want to go to the file that I have in the description link, and you want to click it, click PS4, click Save Data, and you want to get to the number screen on this as well. Now, once you're here on the numbers, you want to simply highlight it and drag it over to your USB just like this. And once you drag it over, it will begin to copy, as you guys can see. Now, once that gets done copying, you simply want to open up Save Wizard, as you guys can see. Okay, now once Save Wizard open up, you guys will see it looks just like this. All you simply want to do is head over to Resign, okay? Once you get to Resign, you will see your file, and you want to double click it now look remember the numbers that we had okay y'all you remember your numbers i know this is mine mine is the 2d uh whatever and these are basically yours will be on top okay and the rest of them will be at the bottom as you guys can see now you see how my thing says my career 003 okay you want to match whatever yours say with the one down here and this this is mine will be 1003 and this one is a 1003 as well that you will need uh down here so what you want to do basically is click on this right click it hit resign uh, this message will pop up. Just hit OK on that. If it does not pop up, don't worry about it. Now, from here, you just want to choose your profile, as you guys see me doing right now. Once you found a profile, whatever uh, your your name is on Save Wizard, all you want to do is apply, and that will begin to resign. All right, now, once that gets done, you will be taken back to the screen like this, and that's completely fine. Now, you're done with the steps on the computer. All you simply want to do is take your USB out of your computer and put it back into your console, and I'll see you guys over there. Okay, now once you guys get back on your console and you know what I'm saying, you load back up to the dashboard or whatever, head over to your settings, right? Then you want to go all the way down to application, save data management, but this time you want to go to save data and USB storage. Once you're here, go to copy the system storage, select 2K20, select the micro 003, and hit copy, all right? And make sure you check apply to all and hit yes. Now, basically what this is doing is we get it to stick to our account so we will be able to use it. Now, uh, once that is done, you're simply good to go. All you want to do is load up 2K20. All right, now, as you guys can see, I'm loaded back up. And once you load back up, all you simply want to do is go to play next game, start up this game, and uh, I'll see you guys once it's loaded up to show you exactly what this glitch did. So, yeah, I'll be right back. Okay. 
Okay, now as you guys can see, or if you cannot tell, everybody in this game is shorter than they is in real life. Look how small this Levert dude is. Look how small Durant is, bro. Durant is straight mini me. All right, so look. Basically, what it's gonna help you to do is you're gonna be able to score way easier. You're gonna be able to do everything a whole lot easier in my career. Now, this is what I do. I say I do. I say just go over here, call for an ISO, call for the screen, simply go to the top of the key and shoot. Now, the only reason why I didn't get no greens because my shot meter is on. I don't understand why the shot meter is on. But anyway, yeah. Basically, what it's gonna do is if you on here, you know what I'm saying, after 2K21 drops, you need to get some badges for whatever player that you want. This gonna be the easiest way to do it. Now, yes, they still do make some bullshit as you guys can see, but they are smaller and you can do whatever you need to do uh, a whole lot easier on them because they are smaller. As you guys can see, look, I would have made it if he didn't found me. But yeah, you get it. Basically, it shrinks everybody just like the demigod glitch used to do. So yeah, there you guys go. Don't forget to like the video. Y'all can do this glitch as when I posted it. Don't forget to do that giveaway. It's your boy Charles 2K. I'm out.